Greetings to our precious Greater Grace family in Baltimore and around the world. From the Grace Mission Church in Seoul, South Korea, this is Pastor Steve DeVries. This past year has been both an amazing time of transition and continuation in all that the Lord has called us to do. We're so encouraged to live this life of faith. We've recently been studying the book of Acts and learning the mindset of the missionary. In Acts chapter 8, the early church was scattered by the plan of God and everywhere the saints went, they continually preached the gospel. And so it is for our team. God's plan has scattered us to Kentucky, Maryland, New York. Others have moved to Thailand, Nepal, and Russia. As our team has been scattered, the Lord has also faithfully gathered our local body members to be more active, initiating times of prayer and fellowship bringing friends to services and classes and ministering God's love in many beautiful ways. The Holy Spirit is moving in our hearts, pouring His love abroad and maturing us as we love one another. Besides this, our local church is blessed and thankful for the season that Pastor Sajun can be trained in Baltimore at home base. We look forward to his return to Korea in July. While I have juggled my time between Lexington, Kentucky and the church in Korea, our church continues to be blessed to have Dan Dunbar serving in Korea. He is a perfect fit for the ministry here. His portion is an extension of home base, an overflowing fullness of wisdom and grace from which he ministers to everyone. Dan continues to lead weekly outreaches such as Bible study with a dozen high school students who escape from North Korea. Also, he leads a Bible study ministering at a local hospital to a mix of medical doctors of various specialties and degrees of faith. Besides these, he regularly offers his counsel to the staff and faculty of a Christian kindergarten downtown. Bible college classes also continue here. I am teaching via Skype. Dan has recently been teaching Christian education classes. This past August, we held our ninth East Asian Conference, where again about 50 Chinese brothers and sisters joined with our local church. We focused on the theme of making God's thoughts our thoughts in Isaiah 55. Please pray for souls in this part of the world as you see us in the news. Tension continues with North Korea. We pray for the collapse of that wicked regime and the end of the unimaginable suffering just across the border to the north. Please pray that the borders would open to the preaching of the gospel and Jesus Christ might be known throughout the land and that the South Korean churches would be ready to win and receive their countrymen into the kingdom of God. We've also been very blessed to have Dr. Chung and Natalia come to Japan in August. Please pray that more finished work trained laborers would come into these harvest fields so that the light of the world may shine brightly into the darkness. If God tugs on your heart, come and join in the work He's doing here in East Asia. Thank you for your prayers. <laughs>